Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have got the Freya's Cauldron sub box unboxing. I'm sorry about the state of my nails. I'm a serial nail polish chipper. I like to chip away at it. Um, so yeah, I'm very sorry about that. Let's try and move past it. <laughs> so yes, today I've got Freya's Cauldron unboxing. So if you'd like to see what is in this month's box then just keep watching okay so first off we've got all the papers for this month i'm just going to pop these to the side and we'll look at those afterwards so the first thing here is the spellkeeper's chest all hallows eve protection bag oh it's got the instructions in it this time usually they put the instructions on the information leaflet but this time it is in Side. So let's have a look at what we've got here. You will need a bag, black obsidian pebble, small amount of Samhain blend, nettle herb, black candle from the candle pack. And we've got a little pentagram charm here made of wood. <clears throat> so that is really really good because as you know on All Hallows Eve the veil is thinned and spirits can walk amongst us so this is a very good thing to have with you and let's have a look at the three tubs that we've got this time Oh, so that's good. We've got the Sabbath of Samhain, which we need for our protection bag. We have got pumpkin seeds. Amazing. I don't have pumpkin seeds yet, so this is a fun one to add to my collection. And I will probably collect the pumpkin seeds that are in this year's pumpkins too, just to add to there. And we've got our nettle herbs as well for the protection charm bag. So that's really good. I wonder what is in this. I wonder if it'll tell us. Um, I'm not very good with the identifying of many of the herbs. I'm not sure if there's catnip in there or what. But I can smell chamomile maybe, can I? My nose may be deceiving me. <laughs> so yes, those are the three herb pots that we have got this month. So this is the black obsidian pebble that is also for the charm bag. It seems that a lot of our box contents is for this charm bag. So let's have a little look at this oh wow oh oh it's got a few little um white spots on that's really really interesting i love that i may actually keep this for my collection and put my other black obsidian stone in the protection bag because this just looks so interesting <clears throat> So that is a lovely thing to have in this month's box. And we have, oh my gosh, we've actually got something to eat. Uh, we've got a chocolate witch lollipop and that is a nice big chunky one. That's amazing. Um, so yeah, I'll probably give that to my daughter. Um, I'll surprise her tomorrow after school. I'll keep it hidden. But she will absolutely love that. Our oil for this month is a protection oil, again, for the protection charm bag. I have already got one of Freya's protection oils and they are absolutely amazing. And they smell divine. So that's a really handy thing to have another one of. Astral Pewter. Let me just zoom 
in just a little bit. Astral Pewter. So this is a witch necklace here. So it's very long. That's very good. And yeah, that's really cool. I guess you could like take it off you wouldn't have to wear it as a necklace you could stick it on a bracelet or do anything you want with that that's really cool these are, are our spell candles for this month obviously it's sour in colors we've got orange brown and black here and it did say that one of these candles was for the protection spell box as well. So that's really cool. I love how like you don't need to really get anything extra outside this box. When she puts a spell kit in, pretty much everything you need is always in the box. And this is the last item for this month. And I know what this is because I have the Mayborn one. This is the sewing plaque. It's so beautiful. It's a cat with a cauldron, a pumpkin. It's even wearing a witch's hat and it's sat on a spell book. That is incredible. I love it. <clears throat> And I've also got my pestle from last month's box because mine broke and Freya very, very kindly reached out to me and said, I will add um, another one in to your next box. And she did, which was very, very nice of her. So I have a pestle to go with my mortar. So thank you very much, Freya. That was really nice of you to do that. And thank you so much for watching my videos, it means a lot. So that's it for the contents inside the box. Let's read up on the paperwork. So I love the paperwork that Freya adds into her boxes because I like to put them into my folder book of shadows that I put all my witch casket and Freya's cauldron sheets in because they're just really handy information. So the protection oil is a very potent protection oil. Our spell candles, black, orange and brown, are associated with Samhain. Black is associated with absorbing negativity for rest, banishing, mourning loss, crone magic protection and reversing hexes. Orange is associated with kindness, intelligence, enthusiasm, attraction, luck, self-control, organisation, strength, intellect and mental clarity. Brown is associated with grounding, earth magic, healing, animal magic, animal spirit guides, building foundations, friendship and the home. And the herb pots that I have got this month were for the Samhain, the nettle and the pumpkin seeds. And it says that there's another info sheet in with the paperwork which we will have a look at. The Sabbath blend is a Samhain one, perfect for making sachets to honour ancestors and can be used in spell work and rituals. And the crystal is a lovely black obsidian pebble. Um, and you, it says you can either use it in the spell kit or you can keep it and change it with black tourmaline, black agate, black onyx. So that's cool. The spell kit is the All Hallows Protection Bag Kit, Pewter Witch Pendant, Samhain Sabbat Plaque, a Chocolate Witch Lollipop, which she's saying is a one-off and won't be done again because she doesn't really like to add edible things into her boxes because some people are vegan, so she doesn't want to leave anybody out with any of her contents. And that's it. And she also says at the bottom of this one that there is literally just her. She's a one-woman band. So when you do contact her, you are speaking directly with Freya. And I have spoken to Freya and she is such a lovely lady. So if you do speak to her, just know that she's going to deal with your requests 
very kindly and very professionally. So we have got our information sheet here on nettle. Uh, nettle uses often include exorcism. Cool. Okie dokie then. And we've got our pumpkin seeds, granting wishes, love, prosperity, fertility, protection when carved. So if you carve your pumpkin, the reason that they are put on your doorstep is to keep all the bad spirits that are wandering around our, uh, well, amongst us from entering our home, which is cool. And then we've got um, a little information on black obsidian, which is actually lava that is cooled off. That is amazing. I love reading these. And she has added some spells for our Book of Shadows, which I did mention I do love to put these into my Book of Shadows. So we've got a pumpkin wish spell here. And it says we need pumpkin seeds, which she has very kindly added into the box and a flowing body of water. So you would need to probably do that maybe outside. Doing spells outside anyway makes them more powerful. Sometimes we can't do them outside and that's absolutely fine. It is the intention behind the spell that matters the most. Uh, pumpkin soup. Oh, incredible. And then there's this really beautiful poem that has been written by one of Freya's subscribers that she's so kindly added in, Hazel Mist. And we have a jack-o'-lantern spell as well there. Uh, one large carving pumpkin and a candle. So I will make sure to do those when I'm carving this year's pumpkins. And then she has also added in some information about Samhain itself and what you can do for Samhain, associations of Samhain and how to honour your ancestors, the Samhain blood moon and Samhain incense if you want to make your own incense. That is incredible. That is one herb that I would absolutely love to get hold of, Vervain. I just love the sound of it. I would love to get hold of some vervain. But that is... Oh, nearly throwing that across the table. That is it for this month, guys. Another amazing box that I have unboxed this month. And they... The... Subscription is £25 in the UK. I'm not sure about anywhere else. She does deliver in other places, but I'm not sure about the prices. So you'd have to look at the website, which I will link down below. So thank you very much for watching another video with me today. And I will see you in my next one. Bye for now.